Hi, welcome back to a new tutorial. Once again, this is the time to revisit our uh, design pattern. And uh, in design pattern reference, let me once again explain this. Once you see us, send an email and uh, then uh, notification will be sent to the Amazon SNS. And notification will be only sent to those SNS notification uh, topics for which we have set for the configuration at the configuration. That means, let me show you here, configuration set. So here is a configuration set. If you see, this is a configuration set YouTube. So in a configuration set, we will decide that where we want to send the notification. Let me once again explain this. A notification will be sent to the SNS that's the simple notification service a topic and then topic will publish this message to the SQS and then AWS Lambda will process that SQS and then finally it will classify whether a mail has been opened a clicked or it is delivered or it is bounced for those uh, classification we need that notification and for that notification we have to set a configuration set so let's set that configuration first and we can set that configuration here and um, we need to click on the configuration set as we already have YouTube configuration set and then we need to specify the destination where we want to publish our email sending events and email sending events are open, send, deliver, bounce, unsubscribe or complaint and oh sorry unsubscribe is not there but yes complaints are there and uh, here you see there are uh, three destinations where we can publish this topic such as a CloudWatch, Firehose and SNS. In SNS there are only uh, few topics such as CS SNS, Bounce Complaints and the DynamoDB. So first of all that we need to create a new SNS topic. So create SNS topic and uh, just give this uh, SNS topic a name as a YouTube. And of course uh, as a display name as a YouTube and then just create this topic. So once we create this topic, now all the uh, sending events will be sent to this notification uh, this topic and uh, once uh, the notification is sent on this topic then uh, we will capture this uh, notification in the SQS so after this uh, after this um, after this uh, configuration set I'll show you how you can create a SQS so just wait for a few seconds to complete this. It is creating a SNS topic and the topic name is YouTube. And in the meantime, I can explain you a little bit more. So in earlier, we have seen how we were sending an email from uh, this uh, developed GUI or you can say the developed application. AI driven digital marketing media lab application but it was not uh, but it was not storing any information at the cloud okay however once we were sending this um, email from here the email um, notification was also not being sent to the SNS topic since we have not subscribed any SNS topic in our configuration set. Now we are going to subscribe a topic. Uh, it's, a, it's a taking a little time. Let's wait for this. So now let's select the YouTube and just save it. And also, of course, we need to give a name to this configuration okay sns destination and uh, let's give again once again youtube and we want send reject delivery bounce complaint click open and rendering failure okay 
and uh, we want to uh, use your Amazon SES default domain to track the click so once all these things are done let's save it in the configuration set YouTube we have uh, given a destination as a YouTube and we have also given a topic as a YouTube that's the SNS topic okay and once again I'll show you in a previous application which I was showing you uh, in the same way I, uh, I have uh, you know subscribe for bounce click complaint delivery open reject and uh, send right now let's come back to uh, YouTube perfect now we are done here with the configuration set now we need to move into SNS so just type here SNS it will open simple notification services so once simple notification services are open we need to go into the topic and in the topic you can see here YouTube and in the YouTube this is the ARN okay so this is ARN topic ARN and uh, after that we need to subscribe this topic into our SQS okay so now let's go to the SQS simple queue services of Amazon web services in SQS we need to create a new queue and let's give a name for this new queue as a YouTube okay and let's select a standard queue and in standard queue what we can do uh, we are not going to change any parameters oh just configure it a little and let's visibility time make it 5 minutes that's when the 300 second and uh, do not change anything else and uh, let's keep it as it is and just create this queue topic now select this queue topic and let's come to the subscribe queue to the SNS topic now select your topic region and after that we need to select here YouTube that's mean if we send our email with the configuration set YouTube then notification will be published to this topic YouTube and all the notification which will be published to this topic YouTube then it will come into SQS services of named as uh, YouTube okay in the queue uh, YouTube and uh, here is the topic ARN which we are subscribing and just subscribe it once we have subscribed this topic click on OK and then we need to once again go back to the SNS and now we can see there this topic has been subscribed by SQS service just click on this YouTube and if you can see here this has been subscribed by uh, SQS service now we are almost set to see this parameter uh, see, see this information so let's come to the simple queue services so once we come to the simple queue services if you see here there is no um, message available and there is no message in the flight and it is created just right now now what we need to do we need to send an email with the configuration set YouTube and then we will see here uh, whether uh, we are able to get the message or not here into SQS now we are going to once again this is test email for KGP Toki for SQS okay just send it so if I press on test send email has been sent to Naran at the gmail.com and if you see here I'm, I must have received that email perhaps it might have gone into uh, yes sign uh, here so this is the area and this is for SQS so let's put it into our uh, update folder and let's check the SQS so there is no message here and let's see here is there any message in this SQS we can uh, weave this message
let me see these messages so let's see one message here and uh, perhaps this is topic here on the CSSNS so this is not current message okay so what we can do we can close this and let me purge this queue first so purge this queue so that we must not get anything there but you see here in the our new YouTube the email the message which we were sent now this message is available into our queue and if we see here into we and delete messages and let's just poll for it um, 10 second and start polling for the messages and definitely we have got this message so one message we might have got for the delivery and one message we have we must have got for open so let's see this message and this message is coming from topic ARN as a YouTube it is working perfectly okay as expected and uh, this is coming for the delivery so the message was sent from sleepwell at the rate sleepwell.tech and uh, you see the message the destination is Naran 16042015 at the rate gmail.com and the next message must have came for uh, open so if you see here delivery type that's the event type sorry event type is the send and here is a mail so one is for send another for the deliver now I must have opened this message so it must get some open notification also let me see if I have opened this yes uh, I have opened this message I must get a notification for delivery as well as if I see it into my gmail let's see let's open gmail first where is gmail Okay, Gmail is not coming there. So what I can do? Uh, let let me show you it once again. It might have got it by now. So let's refresh it. And uh, there is only two. No problem. Let's see it once again. Okay. So here it is for send and this receive count is for delivery. Okay, in meantime we will get that uh, message also, no problem. So we will also get a message for open. Okay, in meantime when we will be developing these applications we will be seeing that. And uh, for this message body what we can do. Uh, we can copy this message body no sorry some button might have got just to press okay okay no problem so what we can do we can go into we even delete messages and let's start polling for this message and uh, then just take any of these messages okay just take any of these messages So now what we can do, we can go into um, JSON Beautifier. So once go, once we go into JSON Beautifier, then we will be able to see it very clearly how this is working. So copy and paste it and just process it. Okay, perfect. Now you see it. You can see it. Type is notification. Message ID is here. Topic ARN is here. And if you match this message ID. You will be definitely able to get it message ID is BD double six and let's match that message ID with the message which we sent uh, somehow which this message ID is not matching no problem I'll see it later and then the topic ARN is YouTube subject is here Amazon SES email event notification okay and here is message message is event type sent mail timestamp that's when the email was sent at this time and the source was this one 
and here is the destination okay and here is the main subject so the main subject was this is the test email from kgp talkie for sqs so don't, don't be um, you know confused with this one so this is not main subject this is subject for this SES also this SNS here is timestamp signatures and other things and unsubscribe URL and here is a message the message must be inside the body let's see where is that message and one more thing here is tag SES configuration set that's the YouTube here is subject okay I think we don't get a message back there so only with the subject name message do not come back here okay perhaps now you might have got all the idea how it is working how SNS is working how SQS is working and how we can create a new topic and how this can be subscribed to the SQS in the next tutorial I'll show you uh, how you can um, how you can uh, um, subs how you can process this SQS and um, uh, then how you can write uh, uh, AWS Lambda function so once you write AWS Lambda function it will process this SQS and then it will delete this message and finally it will classify as we have uh, already discussed into our design pattern reference guide here so thank you so much for watching this tutorial and stay tuned for the next one and please do not forget to subscribe this channel bye bye have a nice day